The top job here in Fairfax County, the chair of the Board of Supervisors, pits incumbent Jeff McKay against challenger and political newcomer Lisa Downing. Now, McKay says judge him tomorrow on his last three and a half years in office. And Downing says she wants to see a more of a voter's voice on the Board of Supervisors. And we asked both of them, how do they feel about raising a potential meal tax in the county? Signs of the Democratic primary pop up outside the Fairfax County Government Center. And among the most prominent, the current chair of the Board of Supervisors, Jeff McKay. Look back over the last three and a half years, uh, this board has done remarkable things. Over Zoom, McKay touts the work he and the board have done. This is a well-managed county uh, with high-performing schools, low crime, uh, and a very progressive view towards, you know, environmental protections, affordable housing. But he says there's still work to do. He wants to see increased funding for mental health, public safety, and a focus on the environmental goals in the county. His opponent, Lisa Downing, agrees with those goals, but disagrees with how things have been going the last three and a half years. Fairfax government is not taking care of its people right now. All it sees are the developers saying, money, money, money. No. Downing says she wants to see all future development go through a process that keeps equity, the environment, and ethics in mind and tables the development of data centers. She feels the current chair and board don't have the best interests of its residents in mind. I think it was summed up when the board voted uh, to give the next board a raise. But they are on the same page about one thing. When the question of a potential tax on meals at restaurants came up, both say it's more complex than just a yes or no. If there's some deal in Richmond where we can reduce property taxes by generating revenue through a meals tax, I'm open to that conversation. Downing echoed a similar sentiment. If we're going to, to find more money, we're going to have to be very careful of how we do it. In Fairfax County, I'm Matt Gregory, WUSA 9. Okay, and if you need more information about the upcoming election, point your phone's camera right at that QR code on your screen, and we will send you a link to our Virginia primary voter guide.